what's up and welcome back to my channel now today I'm going to be talking about the upcoming Hot Toys The Flash Ben Affleck 6 scale Batman and Bicycle Bat Cycle figures so yeah I must admit I was already expecting that uh, Hot Toys was going to give us figures based on that particular version of Batman from the upcoming The Flash film I knew he was going to probably get one based on uh, Ben Affleck but they also are giving us a Bat Cycle too as well now I must admit I think the uh, Ben Affleck Batman from the Pittsburgh scene so far and I guess this really is based on how he looks in the film I think they look just okay I'm not really feeling like how he looks and how like, the Bat suit looks too as well I'm not really feeling that but I must admit I think the Bat Cycle itself looks very awesome but anyway I'm going to get into this right now okay here's the Hot Toys the Flash, Ben Affleck, Batman, and Bat Cycle. Now, I must admit, I was already expecting that we were going to be getting figures based on the Batman from this particular film, or this version of Batman played by Ben Affleck from the film. You know, there was no question that we would have been getting like a figure. So I'm not surprised that they have like finally revealed it. So I must admit, I think the figure, it looks, it looks great. And I guess this really is how Ben Affleck will look in the film too, you know, like his likeness and so on. I'm not really feeling the suit that much. But uh, I think it's still like a great uh, figure, probably just another awesome Batman figure to have. But the Bat Cycle, I must admit, looks very cool. I really do think that is so awesome looking. The Bat Cycle, I'm not going to really say for sure if I'd be willing to pick that up, you know. But I must admit that the Bat Cycle itself really does look superb to me. And of course, it has like lead light features too, as well. But yeah, if anything, I think that's the one that really stands out. Now, the Hot Toys, the Flash. Ben Affleck Batman six scale figure will stand just under 13 inches tall. He will have 28 points of articulation, plus he will have a mask head sculpt with movable eyes, multiple swap out lower jaws, multiple interchangeable hands, a battering, a grappling gun with attachments, a wire fabric cake, plus a display stand too as well. And I think he's going to have more than one Batarang for what I'm hearing. You know, I'm not really too sure. But I must admit, I think this particular likeness to Ben Affleck, I think it looks okay. And I guess it's really based on how he looks in the film. But I must admit, I think it is just like, okay, I'm not really feeling it. Even like the bat suit itself, I'm not really like too big of a fan of. You know, it looks very similar to the uh, Batman v Superman suit. Like the boy, the bat symbol, but I'm still just not really like feeling it, you know, that much. It looks okay, though. Now the Bat Cycle, which I mentioned before, which looks very awesome <laughs> from my opinion. It really does look cool. I really like the look of it. The Bat Cycle itself will be just over 22 inches long and about 8 inches tall. And it will have multiple light up lead features, plus rotatable rubber tires, movable flaps, movable handlebars, side mounted weapons, a ramming attachment, and two display stands too as well. So yeah, you could put both of these together. So yeah, I must admit, both of these are, they do look great together. But like I say, it's really the Bat Cycle that stands out to me the most, you know. Now, in, in the clips from the film, like the trailer, Batman does look awesome. Like when he's riding the Bat Cycle, even when he's just like running around and like, you know, swinging and stuff. It looks very cool, you know. <laughs> now, Hot Toys have these scheduled to be released between the third and fourth quarters of 2024. So yeah, just like next year, and both of these releases are separate uh, releases. Like you can get Batman by himself, or the Ben Affleck Batman. That's what they're actually calling the. Uh, well, I guess they call it Flash Batman Six Scale Figure because I know the uh, Michael Keaton version of the Batman Eighty Nine one. They are calling that Martin Batman, so that does have a name. Whereas like the Ben Affleck one right here is just called the Flash Batman Six Scale Figure. But yeah, both that and the Bat Cycle are individual releases, so you can get them like separately. You know, you can just pick up the Bat Cycle you want, or you can pick up Batman himself, you know. But yeah, the Bat Cycle, I must admit, does look very awesome. I really like how that looks. And I'm sure the Ben Affleck figure will be pretty decent too as well. I'm not really feeling the look of it so far, you know. But I think it would be uh, a pretty uh, decent, uh, like, Batman figure, you know. So yeah, these will be individual releases from Hot Toys, like the Ben Affleck six scale Batman figure and the Bat Cycle itself. And Hot Toys has these scheduled to be released between the third and fourth quarters of next year, 2024. So yeah, I'll probably be up for them because you know it's like another Batman like figure, you know, Ben Affleck Batman. But I must submit like the Bat Cycle itself, like I mentioned before, I think that really looks awesome. I like how the Bat Cycle looks. It looks very cool for my opinion. But like I said, the Ben Affleck Batman, I like that he has like a wire cape and he has like the batarangs and grapple and so on. I just must admit I'm still not really feeling it, you know. Maybe I see like more pictures of, 
of it or see it like a better look of it in person, I probably feel better about it, you know. But anyway, uh, I'm definitely like interested in these, and I probably would pick up the Ben Affleck one, you know. I, I wouldn't be surprised what I do. So, yeah, but anyway, this is the Hot Toys, the Flash, Ben Affleck, ben Affleck Batman, six scale figure, and Bat Cycle. And another thing, too, about this, his particular version of Batman doesn't have a name. Like I said, the Michael Key, like Batman 89 figure, it has a name. It has It's called Martin Suit Batman. Whereas, like this particular Batman, it's just called Batman or Ben Affleck. So I wanted with an adventure to have a name, you know. But anyway, uh, please leave a comment and uh, subscribe too, as well.